A lot of women are now exhausted due to all these trends and old ways of beauty and success. It is in fact very tiring to keep up with every standard that is preset for women. So it is a time to let go of the old and start anew. Sometimes becoming a new version of herself is less about learning the new and more about letting go of the old. Odd ways of being, old thoughts, habit, places, people, and so on. There's a lot of things that you can get rid of. But today, I'm just gonna tell you five simple things that you can let go of and you will become satisfied and happier with your current self. This era was all about competition on social media. You probably wanted to look good, not because you wanted to look good for yourself. We just wanted to compete with your ex's girlfriend. Even the boss women trend is all about competing with men or just anyone online. Competing often takes away from our own unique beauty. It is exhausting to keep other people's thought in your head while waiting for something that won't make you happy, but instead make other people jealous. Everything you do should be for you, not to make someone proud or jealous. So let go of competing against other women, gossiping, comparing yourself, Competing with men, focus all your energy on yourself, your growth, and your unique path. With the freedom of women also came some misconceptions, like asking for help is considered a sign of weakness or dependence on men. Independent women became a self-made woman who won't take help from anyone, even her parents or her spouse. This ideology burdened women eventually putting them in depression and exhaustion. Femininity is all about giving and receiving help. There is no shame in asking for help. To be more feminine, learn to receive help. Sometimes there are circumstances we cannot control. Hard times, sudden life changes, a lot can happen when we're alive. If you're too fearful, too anxious, too much in your head, practice feeling your body. To be more feminine and connected to your feminine energy, focus on your body, your breath, and your heart. Remembering everything is temporary just like happiness. The pain is also temporary. Tackling like problems with wisdom and clear head is the power of femininity. There's no problem without any solution. So never forget to take guidance from your feminine energy in your hard times. Modern women are forgetting about their place in society. As much as we talk about feminism, most younger girls are setting for less. Staying in toxic relationships where men just treat them as fillers. If a man is not willing to show you a future and don't want to settle with you, then he's not the one. The first rule of femininity is to look for a partner who treats you like a princess who's able to give you respect and spot in his life, which is not limited to just bed. The right man will pursue you, he will talk about the future, he'll be consistent and emotionally available. So let go of the men who are not showing up, who are not treating you the way you should be treated. Don't settle down with someone hoping things will get better or that he will change. If you're not satisfied with the type of men you're attracting right now, maybe it is time to pause for a while and focus on yourself and your transformation. Sometimes we are too focused on our careers that we neglect ourselves and find self-care to be a waste of time. To be more feminine, make yourself feel beautiful every day by looking your best. Give yourself at least one day in a week to take care of your hair, nails, and skin. Treat yourself like a princess, or others will too. It will change your mood. You will have more energy. You will be spontaneous to say yes to whatever opportunities the day brings. Thank you for watching and if you like my videos, please subscribe and support my channel. I appreciate it a lot. See you next time.